baseball ideas, they get thrown a lot, some fun stuff. I'm thinking, can we just put bullpens behind the dugout and you don't know who's coming? So, like, pitcher gets pulled from the game and the oh, crowd's yeah. looking around and you're like, I think I know who's coming. But then someone else comes out and it's like, oh, shit. Yeah, we were thought, we thought if they had secret bullpens, it would be pretty, it could cause for some fun drama in games mm. when, like, you, you know, you don't know. So, like, like, they just don't announce. Like, the other, like, so the other team still has the ability to know how because now yeah. you're, you're messing with strategy. Or, or yeah, is this the, just the other the team, the other, no, the other team and the fans has, like, when the pitching change, everyone's like, fucking, who is it? Even the opposing team. Like, maybe, like, they don't think Chapman's available. Right. And then Chapman runs out. But do they have time to... Do they, they can have make time a change to make their, once he's make for, their adjustment? Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so, so, the, so the anticipation is fleeting, but yeah. it's there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. But secret bullpens. We were like, that could be fun for a second. Well, I, I think I like the idea a little better if you're not able to adjust as an opponent. Mm-hmm. That really throws, like... like so you oh, like that more? Yeah, well, because... because okay, well, I, mean, I was only carrying that because I thought you wanted to hear that answer. We like, you can't adjust. Yeah, you can't. Yeah. Well, that's what would make it fun. Yeah. Yeah. Because, yeah. like, that's, say, oh, say, fuck. Yeah. yeah. Like, oh, okay, shit. Uh, well, um, you think Chapman's coming in and then, like, Joe Smith comes out. Right. It's like, oh, shit. Yeah, okay. That's, that's, that, that's, that's the idea of, you know, you send in the decoy up on deck. This is who I've got ready for you. Or yeah. Or you, you got the decoy down in the board. Or like this, like, Soto's up in the playoffs and it's the fourth inning or something, but there's men on and he he's walking to, up, to the, up to the mound and then, or in the wild card game or whatever, fuck you want to have it. And then all of a sudden, Hater comes out in the fourth for the matchup. And you're like, whoa, okay, this is it. That'd be cool. Yeah, and, and the fact that they can't, I mean, not that I don't think Juan Soto leaves the ball game at that time, but that's, no. like, you're talking about a very But it's crucial. a whole different mindset. Oh, absolutely. Sure. Like, I, I, you I just one better, though. turned it up. What do you got? Wrestling uh, entrance ramps. <laughs> so, yeah. like, you okay. count them down like uh, the Royal Rumble. I still like the, like, for when Rodney was coming down in the golf cart in the playoffs. Golf was cart like, was yeah. great. I, lo- old, yes. I love a good bullpen cart. But if you have a, like, a Titan Tron with a, re- a wrestling entrance ramp, and then you have the crowd counting down from, say, 10 or maybe 5, then you have a surprise entry. It goes 3, 2, no, you, 1. And their song and comes yeah, on. And then their song the music plays. comes on first. And yes. then you're like, <gasps> oh, shit. By the way, I hate a role this Chapman. He has the most electric entrance of any major league reliever right now. Why do you hate him? Because he's got skinny legs and big arms? I don't know. I think he did some things. But oh, is the bad guy stuff? Yeah. Bad guy stuff. Yeah, yeah. yeah. off the field bad guy stuff. Robles, yeah. Robles has a pretty... That one's great, too. Has a pretty light. Oh yeah, that one's great. But that they Hansel. need to cut the lights. So hot right now. Yeah. If they're, if they're gonna, if they're gonna, if they're gonna do it, then they gotta do it. No, so, you are right though. Like if, if every reliever had that, like Chase and Shreve comes in, it's like a well, little bit of chicken fried. Yeah. <laughs> like, All right. They, they, yeah. they try. I think for the most part they try. I think yeah. teams yeah. try because mm-hmm. we see like as I you know as I travel around, I see teams that that really do that. I mean, Anaheim being an example. I know at home the Oakland A's they do shit like that for. Were you around the A's for, with Careless Whisper with Reddick? Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. That was pretty cool. Sure. That was great. That was fun. Yeah. He went through a phase with, like, different wrestling entrance themes as well. Woo-hoo. Yeah, he, he was a big, I mean, obviously, he's a huge wrestling fan. Yeah, he is. Yeah. yeah. So, he, I mean, he he played that up. He, he does a great job with bringing that side of his personality into the game. Mm-hmm. It's, uh, it's, it's really cool. He was, I remember, I mean, I him and I were, shit like that. him and I were almost, like, jockeying for the first time that the whole pie thing started in Oakland. Like, him and I were there. He hit him with, I forget who it was, but he hit him with the pie. I hit him with the Gatorade, and that was just a thing. Like, he put on the Spider-Man mask, and it was go time. I, I wish that more baseball players embraced the pump-up song versus the relax song. The pump, Well, I would just do church bells. I think it would be weird. People would be like, what, be the, like, what the hell is that? Yeah. But a lot of guys will come up to, like, country. And then I'd cross myself seven times. Yes. <laughs> just people are like, I asked Brock Holt. Maybe. I was like, your name is Brock. You need to come out to Brock Lesnar's entrance theme. And he's like, I like country music. It makes me relax at the point. Remember when Brock had that there. terrible haircut? Actually, do you know why he cut his hair? Because his kid was like, Dad, your hair sucks. No, he went to visit a hospital, and someone, uh, one of the kids that he was visiting in the hospital was mistaking him for, like, a woman. Yeah, you look like an Oompa Loompa. It was a yes. weird haircut. Like, yeah. you done? They're like, are you a girl? Yeah. He was Speaking like, of, do you regret not having like this get up on the mound? No. No. You not wouldn't at all. have wanted it? No. Why? 
I don't think so. The intimidation factor would have yeah, been Yeah, like you better. look at pictures of you now with the goatee, and I'm like, damn, that guy is lame compared yeah, to this no, guy. No, the radar gun does not lie. Like, <laughs> like, just because I have the beard doesn't make the 86 any harder. It doesn't make a 96. If it did, trust me, I'd have been wearing this motherfucker a It was long a whippy 86. It was so. confident, is what I said. <laughs> very confident. The most confident 86 in the league. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no, um, a, a lot of people, <laughs> it's funny you say that, because a lot of people have been like, man, like, seeing this side of you. Well, I'll tell you this story. Um, it was like throwback day. Uh, we're wearing our 70s jerseys, I think, and I have my Afro picked out. I'm actually in the uh, clubhouses or the <clears throat> clubby's office, and I'm heading out. Billy Bean walks into the office, and he's like, oh, D, the fro picked out. Love it. <laughs> and so I'm like, yeah, good shit. And I roll down. I'm on the bullpen bag, so I've, I've got to get down there early. So I've packed the snack bag, take the bullpen bag down, and, like, I've got my hair picked out, my hat just fucking, you know, in my back pocket. Hair is banging. People loving it. And I get a phone call. I And just listen to how this sounds. I get a phone call down in the bullpen on the bullpen phone before the national anthem from our manager, Bob Guerin at the time. And the phone rings. <laughs> the bullpen coach just looks at me, like, hands me the phone. He's like, hey, it's for you. And I'm like, that's, that's a bad sign. <laughs> no, this <laughs> isn't for me. This isn't good. Uh, this is not good at all. And he goes, hey, uh, would you put that fucking hat on your head if you want to see the mound today? <laughs> sound good and i was like sounds great sounds great but i was so pissed because i was like damn the gm just Bean loved liked it, it. Billy yeah. loved it we just saw billy earlier yeah hey, bob deal. could you go talk to billy real right quick? Like, let's go Come i mean on, i'll put man. the hat on but you just check I, with I, billy I, well, like i felt like the like the little kid who's like you know arguing with his parents like but but dad said it was fine yeah. what do you mean yeah, yeah. yeah. not happy about it